Hey guys, I'm John. Today we're here at the Mishimoto Garage to install the Mishimoto Direct Fit Fan Trap for the Jeep Wrangler YJ and TJ with 2.5 liter and 4 liter engines. Now is a great time to upgrade to a Mishimoto Performance Aluminum Radiator or Mishimoto Silicone Coolant Hose Kit. And because we're going to be draining the coolant, we also recommend picking up some Mishimoto Liquid Chill Full Synthetic Coolant. If you haven't done so already, make sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel for more great Jeep videos. Let's get started on the install. Tools needed for install include 10 millimeter and 7 16 inch sockets, short extension, quarter drive ratchet, half inch wrench, 19 millimeter ratchet wrench, medium flathead screwdriver, adjustable strap wrench tool, a funnel, and Mishimoto's Liquid Chill full synthetic engine coolant. Install time is about an hour and a half, and install difficulty is a three out of five. Using a 19 millimeter wrench, loosen the drain plug on your radiator to drain some of your coolant. You should have a bucket underneath your radiator to catch the coolant draining out. Remove the drain plug first, and after that, you can remove your radiator cap to aid in the draining process. Using a flathead screwdriver, loosen the worm gear clamp on the upper radiator hose. Remove the overflow coolant line from the overflow nipple on the radiator. Next, remove the overflow expansion tank from your Wrangler. To remove it, just pull upward and it should slide out. What you see here is the four cylinder TJ. If you have the six cylinder TJ, you can go ahead and remove the overflow reservoir tank only. For YJ owners, you will follow the same process as shown here. Disassembly may vary between engines and models. On your stock fan shroud, locate the baby half moon on the driver's side and remove the reservoir tank for the power steering pump from it. Use your hands to twist the half moon on the fan shroud and lift up on the reservoir tank. Do not remove any lines from the power steering reservoir, simply let it sit to the side. Next, we want to loosen the nuts that connect the fan to the water pump pulley. To begin, use the strap wrench tool and tighten that around your water pump pulley. Using your other hand, grab a half inch wrench and loosen the four nuts that hold the fan to the pulley. Once everything is loosened, Leave the fan inside the fan shroud. With the fan still inside the shroud, remove both the fan and the shroud together from your engine bay. Don't forget to remove the four 10 millimeter bolts holding your stock fan shroud to the radiator. These will be 7 16 inch bolts if you still have the stock fan shroud bolted to the stock radiator. Using a half inch wrench, reinstall the four nuts you pulled off earlier when you remove the fan for the water pump pulley. Now install your Mishimoto fan shroud using four 10 millimeter bolts. It's easiest to hand tighten the passenger side bolts first to help it go in easier. Once again, we are doing this install on the four cylinder TJ. If you own the 1987 to 1995 YJ four cylinder or six cylinder models, you will not use any of these brackets. Please discard them. If you are doing this install on the 1996 to 2007 TJ six cylinder, you will only use the straight long bracket. If you are doing this install on the 1996 to 2007 TJ four cylinder, you will follow this install video as shown here. Before tightening the fan shroud bolts on the driver's side, install the brackets for the overflow expansion tank. The Mishimoto provided brackets will bolt to each other using the two provided 10 millimeter bolts. Once your bracket setup is built, install the bracket to the fan shroud using two provided 10 millimeter bolts. This bracket attaches to the side of your fan shroud. Reattach your upper radiator hose to your radiator and tighten the worm gear clamp with a flathead screwdriver. Attach your overflow expansion tank to your new Mishimoto fan shroud bracket. Reattach the overflow coolant line to the overflow nipple on the radiator. Attach the reservoir tank for the power steering pump to your new Mishimoto fan shroud bracket. Now that you've finished installing your Mishimoto direct fit fan shroud, the last step is to fill and bleed the cooling system. And for this, we recommend Mishimoto's Liquid Chill Full Synthetic Coolant. If you purchased the optional Mishimoto fan controller, we decided to mount ours on the passenger side inner fender area. For more information on how to wire your fan controller, check out our DIY video. Also, don't forget to click subscribe.